garden of Eden to till it and to keep it. And the Lord God commanded the man, You may freely eat of every tree in the garden, but of the tree of knowledge of good and evil, you shall not eat it. For in the day that you eat it, you shall die. Now the serpent was more crafty than any other wild beast that the Lord had made. And he said to the woman, did God say, you shall not eat from the tree in the garden? And the woman said to the serpent, We may eat of the fruit of the trees in the garden, but God said, You shall not eat of the fruit of the tree that is in the middle of the garden, nor shall you touch it, or you shall die. But the serpent said to the woman, He will not die, for God knows that when you eat of it, your eyes will be opened, and you will be like God knowing good and evil. So when the woman saw the tree was good for food, and that it was a delight to the eyes, and that the tree was to be desired to make one wise, she took up its fruit and ate it. And she also gave some to her husband, who was with her, and he ate. And then the eyes of both of them were opened, and they knew that they were naked, and they sewed fig leaves together, and they made loincloths for themselves. Word of God, word of life. Thanks, Thanks be to God. God. Concerning you, 
and on their hands they will bear you up so that you will not dash your foot against a stone. Jesus said to him, Again, it is written, Do not put the Lord your God to the test. Again the devil took him to a very high mountain and showed him all the kingdoms of the world in their splendor. And he said to him, All these I will give you if you will fall down and worship me. Jesus said to him, Away with you, Satan, for it is written, Worship the Lord your God and serve only him. Then the devil left him, and suddenly angels came and waited on him. The Gospel of the Lord. Praise to you, Lord. 